Good afternoon, YouTube! Digital Adele here, back with another Hoops Profile, this time with Belil Kawabale. I don't speak French, but he's French, teammate of Wemby, consensus number one pick in the draft, but his teammate may be the best player coming from France in this draft. I am super duper excited about this profile. He's 18 years old, six foot six, 230 pounds. Explosive athlete. I just wanna give you some of my notes and measurables on this guy. We're not even gonna talk about the stats. It's EuroLeague. Stats can be deceiving, they're all over the place. I don't really know what his points per game are. Um, I can only tell you what the film says, and the film is exciting. His explosiveness is a 10. His handle with his left hand is an eight. His handle with his right hand is an eight. His finish with his, with his left hand is a nine. His finish with his right hand is a nine. He's seven with a floater, eight on his spot up jump shots, a six with his jump shots off the bounce because we don't actually see him shoot off the bounce that often. He usually spots up, curls in the lane, takes his man off the dribble, or gets to the rack. Um, his mid post game is a five because we really don't see it, it's an unknown. His offensive IQ is an eight. I mean, the way he sets up his defenders for back screens, we're gonna look at that. His footwork is excellent for his age, he's a seven there. Five as a passer because you don't see it much in the offense that he's running. His rebounding is a six. His defensive IQ is a six. His defensive team defense is a six. His competitiveness is an eight. He plays the passing lanes as a seven. I think his defensive characteristics are a lot better. It's just there's not enough tape for me to see. I need to see full games before I can give him that stamp of approval on defense. I think his defensive uh, level is much higher than the ratings that I'm giving him. Here are my notes that I have on this kid. This kid is an explosive talent. He has the athleticism and body control to finish at the rim. He has a nice three-point shot when he gets his feet set. He has a lot of room on his frame to develop and add muscle. He's an excellent defender and stronger than he looks. This kid could be the next big thing in the NBA. I need to see more against better competition. That's why I cannot wait for the NBA Draft Combine. But let's get into some film. Now, I want you to keep in mind that this kid is 18 years old. 18 years old, right there. Takes the con, there was contact on this. I mean, he's highly explosive. Two hands, above the rim, taking the contact, 18 years old, strong enough, throws that down. I mean, that's special. Now, this is what I wanted to show you when it comes to his basketball IQ. Here he is right there. It looks like he's coming for a dribble handoff with the man at the pivot moving to his right. But watch how he sets this up. Oh, beauty, beauty. Sets him up for the backdoor cut. That's high level basketball right there. Nice finish. I would like him to see him use his left. I would like him to use his left hand there, but still a very nice finish even with contact. Now on this play, he's gonna come off the pick and roll. He's right here, and he's gonna go down the lane to his left. Watch the patience as he picks his way through here with the Euro step, and in a nice little soft touch with the right hand floater. That's big time, big time for an 18 year old. Woo! Was that a nice little left to right crossover or what? Again, he uses the screen and roll here. Look at the basketball IQ offensively. He sets this guy up with a nice in and out crossover going from left to right. Absolutely leaves him. Reaching for nothing but air. And look at his big time finish. I mean, the kid, kid's special, man. I'm telling you, he's special talent. Let's take a look at his jump shot. Let's look at the form. Let's break it down. Knees are bent. Feet are lined up and square, his shoulders are square. Elbow is in. Got a nice follow through right here. That's a beautiful looking stroke too. I 
All right, let's take a look at his basketball IQ. There's Belil right there. As you can see, his man right here turned his head. He sees his teammate driving baseline. He sees that. So he's going to use that to his advantage to move without the ball, cuts right down the lane for an easy pitch. For a young guy, for a young guy, that is special. Again, just understanding and feel of the game at 18 years old. Now let's take a look at this jumper again. This is another example of his great mechanics shooting his jump shot. Look at his feet, look at his legs, his knees are bent. Get some nice arc and follow through on this shot. He's got a nice shot, man. I'm telling you, he's got a nice form for an 18 year old. Now again, I just want to highlight the basketball IQ and his ability to run, rim run, and finish with that freaky athleticism that he has. He makes the pass ahead, fills the gap, goes up and gets it, throws it down with two hands. I'm telling you, he's a special player. Now here's an example again of his freaky athleticism at 6'6 and agility. His ability to handle the ball and finish in the open court is uncanny for 6'6", 230. Watch this play right here. Gets the ball, nice little behind the back dribble to his left hand, takes it down with the left, Euros to his right, makes it look easy. Now this competition may not be the best competition in the world, but you can see the skill set and how it'll translate. I'm really interested to see him in the NBA Combine against the other elite talent. Let's take a look at it. Um, Belil coming off this pick and roll here. Belil's right here with the ball. He's going to come off going to his right. He gets a little stuck, a little back dribble to create space. And watch this little left to right crossover. Too quick. Oh my goodness, a little up and under. Smooth, man. The body control, spin control, the touch for being 18. Uncanny. It's simple right here. He's just going to be an athlete. Go get it. Go make a play for your team. Nobody boxes him out. Too good of an athlete. Nice little pull-up J. Nice little pull-up J. I like to see that that's in his game. Again, you want to talk about him being a freak athlete. Here we go. Off the double staggered screen. Coming downhill. Going to his right. Really poor defense by the guy in the corner. Also by the uh, second guy dropping. He just blows by everybody. Gets to the launch point. Two-hand finish and one. Uber athlete, man. I mean, this guy's got... He's a three-level scorer. This kid is a three-level scorer. Legit no joke. Nice little crossover up the screen. Knocks it down. This play plays a passing lane. Nobody's going to catch him. He's too good of an athlete. All right, let's talk about his ability to pass the basketball. This is Belil right here. Going to run this through. Comes off the pick and roll. Somebody's open. We've got options. He's got options. We got guy in the corner here. We got the roll man right here. Let's see what he does. Comes off the screen. Nice little look away for the open layup. Oh, baby, that's big time. So right here, Belil's going to get the ball in the mid post area. I love to see 6'6 six, six athletes get the ball in the mid post. It destroys zones. Look at that size, being able to see over the defense having a feel for where the defenders are. He, look at big man, big fella, sealed his guy. And look at all this open area to pass the ball. I love it. I love this. I love this. I love this. That this is in his game. Nice. That's going to serve him well at the next level. Again, Belil getting doubled here. Out at the top of the key. Coming out of this double team. He's going to spot his roll man. There's the roll man. Roll man's wide open. Right there. Wide open. I would prefer this to be a little bit sooner. But look at that. Left-handed on the money to the roll man. The fact that he made that pass with his left hand. Again, he's 18. Wow. It's special. Bad pass. 
This is where he's going to need to get a little bit better. That pass was... You need to put this pass right on him. This pass needs to be right between the, the numbers. Right between that four. This is where the ball needs to go. Instead, it's out here. That's something he's got to clean up. It's going to come with time. In the NBA, that guy wouldn't have been able to get that shot off. So that was a poor pass. Okay, I like that. I mean, he didn't get all the way over there. I mean, he tried. I'll give him an A for I'll give him a A for effort. Let's pause this. Let's take a look. He's worried about this guy in the corner. I get that. But if you're gonna commit to help, you gotta get your full body in front of this guy. You gotta get your chest in front of him. He kind of half commits here. That's a young guy mistake. See how he half commit? He needs to be over here. He needs to get his chest in front of him. Take that charge. That's a young guy mistake right there. I mean, his length caused me. I, I didn't like that rep. You're either going to fake and retreat, or you got to get your whole chest in front of the guy. Be an athlete. <laughs> He just goes up and gets that. Here it is again. A little chase down action for you. Love that you went with two hands. Nice D. Get that out of here. Stay down on the pump fake. He stayed down on the pump fakes. That's, again, uncanny for an 18-year-old. This will help D get in the passing lane there. Use that length on the inbounder. Mm, got super long arms. Again, he was waiting on that. Good recognition. Lucky. Good D. Way to sniff that out. He could have been lazy right there. That could have been an easy bucket. But he sniffed that out. I like that. Be an athlete. I mean, go be an athlete. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I like all that. He's going to finish that, too. <laughs> oh, man. Didn't get the end one. Oh, my goodness. Wingspan for days. Lazy D on that. That's lazy D right there. That's a foul. Either you go in with two hands or you don't go in at all. He's just hacking. You need to go in and slide your feet and get over there. We're going with two hands strong to get the ball. Yeah, that's a poor defensive possession. It's going to make the highlight reel, but I don't like it. Get that trash. Nice anticipation. Again, with the long reach, man. He's got the tools. He's got the tools. My man's got the tools. Two inch strong against the glass. Pinned. I mean, he's going to be elite. I really think he's going to be elite. He has a chance to be elite. Well, that is it for me today, guys. That is Balil Kouabale. 18 years old. This dude has the potential he is no ceiling no roof you hear that thrown around a lot but he really has the potential to be a three level scorer and an elite defender he's got it all this guy is my steal of the draft every team in the nba could use this guy i mean i'm that high on him now i would like to see him against better competition i really can't wait to see if he competes and any of the pre-NBA stuff uh, before the NBA draft. I really would like to see that competition. But really, there's nobody even close with that skill set to me. I mean, Wembley is, suppo Wemby is supposed to be the most complete draft prospect we've ever seen. I'm not sure he's better than his own teammate. This kid could be better than all of them. I really believe that. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. If you like the content, hit a like. If not a dislike, subscribe for more. Take care. Stay safe out there, guys.